So today I'm observing in a prescribed burn here in Central Florida. Um, these burns help maintain the habitat so they don't become too overgrown, helping the animals live in them better. It's a, it's a major part of maintaining a forest since there's so much fragmentation in Florida now. So the lightning doesn't do its job and cover areas because of the fragmentation. All the roads are, are fire breaks. So it has to be done in all the, the wildlife management areas and forests. So basically we're doing a plan of attack and we're going over the aerial map of the unit 3W. We're gonna do a nice backing fire. We've got northwest winds. Um, safety zones, I never talked about safety zones. It's gonna be the main road, blacked out areas. It's my prescription by the way. Just got a little burn mark. So after the fire, everything's cleared out. All the duff is burned up. These palmettos all come back better without all that dense vegetation that was growing up through it. Open up, open story, better for animals. Knock down some of these oak trees, the new oak trees that were growing.
So here's uh, most of this track burned already. Um, I'll come back in a few weeks and even in the winter you'll be surprised the difference here. Well, that was a prescribed burn today that I uh, got to uh, be a part of. I will come back, I don't know, maybe three or four weeks and I'll film what it looks like in that section of the burn. So we can see how the forest comes back even better, even in the winter time in November. So. Stay tuned. So I'm walking through the area that was burned weeks ago and here's some new growth right here. And you can start seeing the little bit of green coming out. As everything starts coming back. Except for all that dead dried up vegetation. With all these new grasses and vegetation, the animals will move in to eat the seeds, the insects will come in, and the food chain and ecosystem is even better. So the animals will be moving in from the adjacent tract. Here's another tortoise burrow. And this is where the animals would go, besides the tortoise. And little holes over here, you just go down. So this is definitely an escape for animals. That's why gopher tortoises are the keystone species in Florida and are protected, fully protected. So these old dead pine trees provide an excellent root system. For animals. Snakes love to go down in the root system of pine trees. These systems hollow out as the tree dies, leaving little tunnels under there. Leaving, a, leaving tunnels underneath. When I was tracking pine snakes, I tracked a few pine snakes down in the root systems of these trees. Very important when they log to leave the stumps. <laughs> 